Você escolhe um dos três palitinhos, pô. Mas eu vou dizer, você vai perder, mano. Tá aí, ó. Desculpa, uh, olá. Fala inglês. Uh, I'm a little lost, perdido. Onde é uh, uh, tu? Tá no lugar errado, rapá. I need a phone, a telephone. Bora. Public call. A gente não é centro de informação turística, não. Well, they weren't going to help me. And who could blame them? I was a dumb American in a place where dumb Americans were less popular than the clap. Hmm. If I was going to find my way out of this mess, I was on my own. Fair enough. Like there was a bar up ahead. The irony was not lost on me. Hmm. I figured sobriety was no use to me ah, dead. Fuck you. I go where I want. Oh my god. Well, if you see jumps in this next part, I apologize. Oh, yes. Phone, so I could call Passos. Either that or a gun. Well, I have to edit parts of this out. It's understandable. When you're stuck in a foreign country and you don't know the words for reverse charges, and you're in some lonely skin joint in the middle of some poor slum, having just had every last cent robbed from you, and you call yourself a bodyguard, then you know you're a loser. Hey, Matt. Can I buy you a beer? What the hell's that? Do I know you? I don't think so. Shoot it. Make it quick, I'm a little busy. If I was going to shoot you, I wouldn't waste a beer. Wait, you won't try to dry out of this. Just a second. Oh, guys, yeah, really. Why don't you go sit down? Huh? Why don't you go sit down? Why don't you go sit down? Interesting haircut, by the way. Wilson da Silva. Well, I would have to <laughs> have edited stuff out of this video. Nice to meet you, I think. <laughs> Although you'll forgive me I if I promise these. never to employ you as my bodyguard. You did a great job watching after Rodrigo Bronco. Fuck you. Uh. You were set up. Bet your ass I was. Now, let me ask you something. Have you ever seen this guy? Serrano. Yep. He's a real sweetheart. Yeah, you sure put his gang out of business. But don't worry, those guys, they're a small fry. This is the guy I'm interested in. Neves. And this is his little buddy here. Milo Heger. Hmm. They work for this vigilante group. Crash a Preto. Yeah, I know him. Well, they're very popular with right-wing politicians. Like Victor Brown. Now, you see, many years ago, he helped clear some villages on a bit of land Rodrigo Bronco wanted to develop. Rodrigo Bronco? Yes, he did some very bad things. Anyway, have you ever seen this guy? Maybe at the stadium. I knew you were involved in that business. You know, I wanted to investigate that, but I got an order to blame it on some local street kids instead. Tell me, what happened there? Nothing, we... Simply went to hand over some cash to this guy's clowns for a, a ransom exchange when this guy's clowns jumped us and they shot everybody. Apart from you and your boy Passos. That's right. Yeah. Well, we had to shoot our way out of there. <laughs> they let you go. <laughs> it's okay, it's a little weird right now. But I know that Victor Blanco is involved in all this. I just don't know how or why. And I know that the Cufe are involved in all this as well, but I just don't know how or why. Hmm. And you know what's going to happen? The moment is going to come along 
when I put all these pieces together, and at that moment, someone is going to come along and put a bullet in my head. Anyway, listen. I think you might want this. A gun? Yeah, probably. I'll need it. And if so it's he's saying that... Bronco, you've come looking for? I think she's up the hill. So he's basically saying that Rodrigo's so brother is involved in all of this. I'm a cop. I mean, I'll fight corruption. I'll stand up to the rich and dumb, but if I go up that hill right now, I'll be dead in three minutes or less. Maybe you too, Max. You're in the jungle now. So it appears. Hmm. You survived the next. Especially with my shirt. Let's speak. You help me, and I'm gonna do what I can to help you. Good luck. I didn't know what to make of what this guy had just told me. What was true and what was just someone else's convenient bullshit. Then some let me in the wrong mood to party. Let's have a gun now. Yeah, you agree. It's a tough one, Louis. No comprende. Leave me alone. Você tem alguma coisa para mim? Do you got something for me? For you? I'll tell you what I got. I got a gun, and if anybody thinks they're gonna take it from me, they'd be dead wrong. Huh. Ow. Fuck you. There's like no cover. Message to the CS from a cop who was apparently too scared to go near any real criminals. It was a strange power play. Outside of bullets. Here we go. Here we go. Now I got an assault rifle. The right. show was now we're talking about. It was time to get Now we're talking, I mean. Not now we're talking about. That wasn't English. Some naked chick. More medicine. Like it. I don't see any. It was 
was Monday afternoon, and I'd already been thrown out of a party, gone to a strip club, and no. got into a bar fight. This latest midlife crisis was certainly ticking all the boxes. Can I get through the store over here? No. É o gringo. Ah, não sei. Tô vendo porra nenhuma. A gente desce ou não? Foda-se. Fuck you. Isso aí. Isso aí já era. Não vale a pena, não. Tá certo. Vamos lá. O fireworks display was clearly in my honor. Making sure everyone knew to roll out the red carpet for their surprise guest. Great. That's what I need. 